In Estero, there is a new dramatic voice that's capturing a lot of attention of artists in the area. Gulf Shore Opera's new tenor, Leonid Shoshan, has more than just art. He is also a Ukrainian military soldier. Yeah, he served eight months on active duty defending his home in Odessa, Ukraine. And Gulf Shore Life's culture and arts reporter Jacqueline Kizik captures his story. <laughs> You hear this strong, powerful voice coming from Gulf Shore Opera's new tenor, Leonid Shoshan. But in the back of his mind, he hears these sounds. I'm still in shock. I still can't believe. Leonid was on tour in Germany when he heard the news Russia invaded Ukraine. That's when he went from a navy blue tux to this green military uniform, becoming a volunteer soldier looking for traps and bombs from Russian troops. People die every day because of rockets and, and like all civilization in the world can't stop it. Can't. But it's not to be sure it's my life. It's my my parents' life, my, my, my friend's life. It's real thing. People really die. According to Gulf Shore Opera's general director, Stephanie Pierce, it's been a year-long process to get Leonid a visa to come perform for the local opera company, making his first American debut as Prince Khalif in Puccini's famous play, Turnadon. He had to work with his opera house to get a release. You have to prove that they've been working internationally and have won international awards. Leonid feels welcome to be here in Southwest Florida. You want to live in this society because these Ukrainian people right now know what life is more than any they appreciate we appreciate life more than we, that we know that what it is a privilege to have a peaceful freedom life. Leonid will be working with Gulf Shore Opera for the next two months until his visa expires then he'll go back to Ukraine to be with his family. His leadership and performance in Tornada will be showcased within the next couple of weeks. In studio Jacqueline Kissick for Gulf Shore Life.